first of all, let's say that that um, this relationship is one based on caring and on love. Okay? If it's one based on caring and love, then it only takes one to love. It doesn't take two. In other words, you can love someone, and if that someone, let's say, is shallow or has a lot of fear and has a, a lesser capacity to love, that's okay. You just let them be however they are, and you love them just the same. You do things for them. Uh, you try to make them happy or whatever, and realize that they have limitations. Their capacity is only so much. That's okay. So you can get along just fine and don't have that feeling of loneliness because when they say things or they brush you off or whatever and you want to go into, into something deeper, you just have to let that be because you let them be however they are. You don't try to make them be what you want them to be. You let them be who they are and accept that as who they are and love them because that's who they are. See? If it's a need-based relationship, then that doesn't work so well. In a need-based relationship, you have needs and you're expecting uh, somebody else to fulfill those needs. And when they don't, then you feel lonely or put out or it's not working. Okay. If the relationship based on love is, is such that, that uh, you can't, whether it's your capacity to love is not great enough, or whether there's just not enough value in that relationship to make it worth your while, well, then maybe you need to change relationships. You see? So if you're in a, in a, relation, a relationship, let's say, that's abusive, to take one that's, that's more dramatic, well, you don't have to stay in that. Then you may love that person, but the right choice would be to move on, you know, go someplace else, start another relationship. You may still love that person forever, but it may not be a practical or good place for you to grow, for you to grow up in. So then you might want to change relationships. On the other hand, if a person is only mildly ab abusive, let's say they're, all their abuse is just um, verbal in the sense that they are constantly complaining or constantly uh, unhappy about something or whatever. Well, that's okay. That's just the way they are. You can still give them a kiss and you know, try to make them feel good when they can, but you can just accept them the way they are. They're grumpy. That may not be a big deal. You know, but if they hit you with a frying pan, you know, every every other day, then it's probably time to go, you know, probably time to go someplace else. That's not a good relationship. You need to get out of it. So it depends.